What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with another episode of our Rise of the Republic co-op campaign as Rome and Syracuse with myself and Scrim, who's, Hello. who's making noise in the background apparently, I don't know what he's doing, he's ve been very unprofessional, I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> um, but in the last episode we had some great uh, action between the Samnites and Rome over the, uh, over the settlement of Compsa, where I was victorious. Indeed. And then we yes, had. Yes, I do enjoy playing beat shields. Yes, and then we had another one against uh, the slave, some random rebels, and another garrison army at uh, Capua, or Capua. I don't know how you say that. And then I also won that because again, Scrim just loves meat shields. Um, They're just useless. Light infantry are useless. Yeah. So um, that is unfortunate, but uh, yeah, I think I've basically done. The plan is to take Neapolis out this turn, uh, like in the next few turns, and. Um, that will sort of secure this like Campania for mo most of Campania. Then we're going to go, well, we're going to deal with this Region transport army that's down here. Um, then we'll go north to maybe deal with the Herpini and the uh, Pelengi. And then maybe go further north after that and go and take out uh, the Sabines, which we still haven't taken out, which one of the first people you should really take out apparently is Rome. Um, but yeah, so I'll, I think I've basically done everything. I can't move any more armies or there's no armies I want to move. Um, so I think I'll hand over to you, Scrim, and I'll okay. let you let you do your thing. I think we ended, and I basically wrapped up yep. my turn. Um, my allies are moving against Carthage, which is nice. Oh god, there's two stacks now approaching Carthage. I may have to lay an ambush somewhere, to be honest. But um, whether I'll be successful is another question, because they're close to landing. Although they could actually attack the settlement, so I can't really leave it either. Hmm. My allies seem to be poking around with their meat shields. <laughs> My allies in the town sense that I can't actually tell what they've got. Oh, meat shields, okay. <laughs> yeah, apparently I'm the most heavily armed person apart from yourself on the continent because literally everyone's using militia or Well, peasants. I don't know. This Regian army's got quite a lot of hot plates in it, it would seem, and some light hot plates, which I know aren't great, but hot plates are pretty good. Well, as long as they've got some form of armor. But they look, um, they look like they might have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine uh, missile units. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah. Okay, so... Ugh. Is this in the sea as well? Yeah, yeah. Oh, joy. Luckily, I haven't got a navy yet, so... Uh... So where do I need to go? I need to go past Rome up to Aphelia. Yeah, you're, so... a, long, you're a long way off, though. I've not even seen your navy yet. Actually, no, no I know where it is, though. It's, um... Yeah, it's down here. It's going to take about 10 turns to even get to Rome, let alone the 15. It'll get to, um... Athelinia, which is their capital with a half stack, a single general and a single single admiral. So that would be a very easy settlement to take out. Or well, you hope so. Uh, the, only, the only settlement they have too, so that would be a good start. I think they've got iron there too, which would be a good grounding for our military forces. Well, if you feel like it's the effort to go all that way, then you, you're welcome to do that. Oh my god, Regan sending a second navy or a second fleet, a 17 stack, Jesus. Um, in the meantime, I need to figure out what I'm going to build because I want to wait until I can get another. Ju ju oh, shit, here we go. Ju ju Julie, uh, yes, we're going to build another Julie. Um, Julie's Julie. going to build build some <laughs> fancy shiny metals for us. Until then, I know she's doing a wonderful job in that city. <laughs> uh, right, okay, let's uh, upgrade this guy. He's doing a wonderful job. That's yeah, that's uh, boop. We have a second. Yeah, he's doing wonderful there. Who else needs upgrading? No one. Okay, let's get this going. I'm doing the intelligent thing, but it's taking so long to do oh it. Oh my god, the Samanites are besieging Neapolis. <laughs> yeah, I just saw that as well. <laughs> They're that desperate. They're like, well, if we can't have a settlement, neither can you. <laughs> Poor Neapolis. I'll just kill the Samanites and... Oh, okay. Neapolis is going to attack my army with a agent called Cylon. 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 Yes. Not Sri Lankan Cylon, but yes. <laughs> oh, okay. It looks like they pushed back the Samurites. They may have killed the Samurites. <laughs> and Carthage has come in yet. Yeah, I saw that. You might need to send an army after that, might you? There's an army there. Ooh. Oh, the people I'm about to invade want a defensive alliance. Oh, and I've got treaties with them, which I'm going to have to break. Did you make the alliance? No. Oh. Croton's pretty strong. I'm going to need to take out that small... Uh, 
like the small settlement that they have just over there on their own. At I'm some not gonna lie, the four Greek factions. Me. Oh, and the Sabines have declared war on me. There you go. Oh god. The Sabines decided to uh, make the leap themselves. Well, I have got an eleven stack nearby that can probably hold them off. And the first place that they can attack is Vei. Well, that's good because the Sabines had a. Ooh, and Regions landed. Re Re Regions doing some remarkable things at the moment. Yeah, and angle. the Sabines have actually. The Sabines aren't dead. I thought they were dead. They've just besieged a different. My Selvan instead. How kind of them. <laughs> Neopolis looks like it's going to have to be put on hold then. Uh, Region really is doing some stuff. Mm, oh, they bribed a unit! And there's a rebellion that's going to. Blimey, a lot of stuff's happening. <laughs> uh, good fun. Have luck. Um, so the Cod good fun. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Have fun. Have luck. Good fun. Um, so basically, the Scythians uh, they didn't like what I did. Basically, the Patricians were happy. The Plebs not so happy. I can live with the Plebs not being happy. Um, well, it looks like yeah. It looks like I can't do anything there just yet. Um, right. We do might have a problem. So Regian landed there. Well, both of the settlements that the Sabines are near are walled settlements. Oh, and the, all three, okay, wrote that they border Rome as well. Okay, so that's not a problem. So we could probably splat, splat these people. I'm definitely going to probably try and attack these guys then. Um, I'm going to move into Freglia there. So you're garrisoned. Um, you can move up to go and deal with Regian. I'll say, oh, what are you? Upgrade? Sure. You know, I kind of wish I didn't make this alliance with the Greeks. I wish I could just push up the boot of Italy. <laughs> you can wish all you want, sir. I can do it now. My armies are not too far away. Oh. Might, might be worth a try. I mean, it's just... Mm, not sure. I mean, um... plan to take out the economy of Carthage at this rate, so... A meeting place there, that'll be good. Let's take... Oh, okay, I don't like Taurus, it's just camped there on my border. The Salmonites... Where are they? I don't know. I can't take out flipping... Thingy now. Oh, uh, the Salmonites, because they're... Back in their own land. But that's fine, we can deal with them another time. Another time. Right, who bribed a unit? That was a... That was the main question. You had units bribed. Oh, Blumenek. Oh, dear. Right, we need to start killing off some of these flipping agents. They're becoming a problem. Uh, maybe you... Aren't uh, no. I'm going to move you here just anyway, because then you're more in... I don't know, territory that I know. Are you at war with the Samanites? You might be, but I don't think there's any way in hell you... Oh, not Samanites, Neapolis. You are, but there's no way in hell you're taking that settlement. You've got ten units. Um, you can carry on over here. I'd really like... Oh, a positive outcome, 55%. Sure, that's... My, uh... Knowledge... Oh, he failed still. My knowledge in statistics or percentages would make me think I'd win that. But no, apparently not. Um, yeah, I'm down on a fair amount of money. I'm going to try and... I'm going to start recruiting more troops anyway. Need more boys. More boys for the army. And more cavalry, that means. More cavalry, yes. We could make this a 17 stack. Uh, no, let's make it a 16 for now, that should do. And we can move you up to Rome, I'm sure, next turn. On a fairly good force march. You, I don't think, can reach... Actually, you might be able to reach Castanum on a normal... But you're a 10. You might be able to certainly damage that and if not we can definitely condemn them next turn which is fine um, can you recruit any troops here oh actually yes you could you could recruit two swords actually no recruit one sword and one spear <laughs> sorry no I was just listening to you witter away, away witter away yes I'm just thinking uh, what I'm going to do when Region flipping lands and then it's landing once it's going to land again that's the thing that's what, all I'm concerned about <coughs> as you die in the background. It's really, I should probably should have knocked out my ally in Sicily as well. Mm. Salmonum's going to have a rebellion again, which is not brilliant. Might have to deal with that. Uh, any more? Was there any other possible rebellions? Invasion Force lands? No, not worried about that. Rebellion imminent. 
Slightly worried about that. Oh yes, protection's nearly over. Ah yes, this is that could be a problem. Did you get Civil War one percent, wasn't it? What? Uh, it's going to be over in three turns. Both the people actually do kind of like me at the moment. Minus two and my and plus twenty four. We're doing mm. all right there. My popularity is decreasing. I just realised. Um, Why do you hate this? two buildings while well, taxes events? Okay, just events. Okay, that's fine. Um, so I'm going to end the turn. Oh, there you go. It's over to you, Scrim. You can uh, do your worst. So well, There's it now looks a high like... chance of civil wars. Ooh. What I just got here, nineteen percent. Is that high? Nineteen. Yeah, I'm down to zero again. I've just secured the loyalty. Oh. Uh, right. What am I doing? Let us do this. Oh, there's already a rebellion in Salmonum. What's it on about? <laughs> it's already a rebellion here. Oh, it's just it's just happened as I ticked over. Okay. Okay. That's fine then. Okay, right. I'm making two and a half grand income now, which is nice. That's not bad at all. This technology boost was quite useful. Um oh, I'm making I'm thinking about new decisions now. Uh do I want to go down and just take out my old ally? Just take out Region. Take out Region. They're a better. I'm more, I'm more thinking about the ones in Sicily, actually. Yeah, I know. Just it's consolidate a, it. A Scragas or whatever they're called. Yeah, I want to consolidate it, but then I've got Carthage on my doorstep everywhere. Um, I, I thought they were a good buffer at one point. I thought you said, but they were a very good buffer, but now they're just kind of taken away from any potential income I can get. Yeah. Hmm. I probably shouldn't stop. Um. Political party affiliation. Okay. Oh, this place is affiliated to them Campania, which is oh, hell. such a long march. Yeah. I might actually risk it and go across the sea just to hit Carthage on the flank. I go for Terranora, maybe. Hmm. I'm gonna see if I can, after I've defeated both these armies of Reagan, where I can make a peace treaty. Because I'm sure they'd love a peace treaty after that. Send them a spy into the ocean a little bit, see what happens. Just, oh no, it is deep waters. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go disappears. around. Cheer. Yeah, oh yeah, you couldn't just make a direct Four, five, six, direct seven, eight, for nine, it. Ten, Jesus. There is uh, lots of whales. It means that it's deep water. Indeed. Uh what should I do? Because the thing is they moved all the navies to the point where I could turn around and actually hit Carthage in its home front. Up to you. Um I'm not going to suggest anything. Nah, so I'll keep on the track. I've committed. Okay. You do you. You're ending your turn, I presume, yes. Yes. Yuck. Here come the summer nights again. They're just. Oh, and. Okay, I thought Taurus was going to take them out, but no, they just walked on through. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. They're just like, nah, we'll just. Just leave them there. Oh, and Kapua, not Kapua, um, Neopolis is bribing people. And another one! <laughs> Your army's having some uh, joyous times over there, I can see. Uh, yeah, we're, we're doing fine. It's just the agents is just very annoying. I could probably go and take out Neopolis as well if I uh, made the brutal... Oh, Carthage moved on my ally. Oh, this is a really good opportunity, actually. Carthage pulled back one of its fleets, though, or one of its armies, whatever it is. I've just seen. So you might... There's still a lot of uh, forces out there. Croton's doing things as well. I don't really want Croton to take Neapolis. That's the last thing I want. And here come the I Sabines. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. The Sabines don't look like they've got big armies. They have like an 11 stack. Region, what are you going to do? Oh my gosh, they're going to go for the army that I thought they might. What? Okay. What An interesting decision. An interesting decision. Have they got meat shields? So I ain't gonna play if it's got meat shields. Um, they have hot plights. They have five units of hot plights, and they have some cav. But you're going into five more units of hot. Plights. You're going into more. Ah. You, you can. You don't have to play if you don't want. You can just watch. No, no go on, go on. Let's, let's see what happens. Yeah. You, oh. This is a good. Hell. This is. A, I outnumber you. Actually, no, I don't. But I probably have better troops as well. 
Because you got melee and I got spears. Melee beat spears. You can just mm. watch it. You can just watch as they die if you would rather. No, let's do this. Okay. Another, just... another battle in another city. <laughs> anyway, I'll see it, you guys. Just in a... so, I just don't get what the AI are doing. I know. I'll see you guys in a moment on the battlefield. Anyway, so we are back on the battlefield and, well, we're just getting ready to set up. I'm just going to see what Scrim does and uh, basically respond to that. <laughs> I think it's a shame that you can see what I'm doing. I think in the later games you can't actually see what I'm doing. Maybe, yeah. I think you can still, certainly like Attila, you certainly can. I think Thrones, I think it might be like Warhammer and... Um, Warhammer, I've been getting into a lot of Warhammer recently. It's yeah. quite good. Might be 3K. Oh, uh, 3K you might not be able to see anything. I don't actually know what to do. I've got more archers than I have spearmen. <laughs> yeah, or good spearmen uh, anyway, yeah. Yeah, um... Hmm. Yes, Commander. Yeah, it's gonna be a rough one for you. Put it like that. It's good for me because I get the experience of using these armies and trying my best to use them. But I just oh, this is just the map like... we used like however many turns ago. It's literally a carbon copy. It is. I guess that works in my favour. Well, it works in both our favour because we both played on it. But um, it worked out better for me than it did for you. Put it like that. I don't even know really where I'm putting all my troops. It's so condensed in this small city. Thing is the armies I'm used to fielding. I remember the first time I played you, I actually defeated you as well because it's just such a change for me to have such unorganized armies. You're gonna keep re reminding me of that, aren't you? You beat me the first <laughs> time we played. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's changed since then. I've learned how to beat you. <laughs> it's rely on the AI to just bring a load of rubbish and. Uh... <laughs> that's not being me. That's yeah. relying on the AI to be shit. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, well, let's see okay. When our armies let's see when our armies actually conflict. <sighs> That'll be the day. Whether, <laughs> whether, in, whether in this campaign or within the grand campaign, which I believe is our next campaign, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's uh, the grand campaign. I think is the next one in the timeline. If you do I've that, I actually lost by the timeline notes, which is really annoying. Let's go through all again. Well, why don't you just send up your hot plates to die? We'll see, we'll see what happens from there. Sons of my actually no, not you. Not you either. Send you up. <laughs> Lucky for you, I think you have the skirmisher advantage. If I can get them close enough, I. Yeah. I just there is that. that <laughs> give me something that's decent, useful, actually soldiers. <laughs> Actual <laughs> men that will like hold the line. <laughs> yeah, stuff like that. I mean, when I sent, when I had the last army of mush, even though the silver chevrons light against heavy, don't work. Yeah. Unless you hit the sides. Even though. Oh. I'm not gonna do this. Well, now I know where you're coming from, I will start to move my troops back into the spots I planned on like having. Them. I like you, how you can see like some of my units. Like you can just see my. Apparently, you can see my general though he's behind a fuck off like huge temple. <laughs> yeah, I can see him right there. It's like, oh yeah, that, that that seems to work out. Um, have you there? Have you like there? Oh yeah, you you've got archers. Interesting. We have a lot of archers and a lot of slingers. Ready and 
Uh, no. Hold your ground. Hold your ground and do such. Lots of thinking going on here, I can see. Uh, always know when you've, you're you thinking, Scrim. You just... Go very silent, yeah. yeah. Think, pondering how you're going to do this. Some good jabby throws there. Proud Romans all. That's three. I just realised, are they actually doing anything? Move up. The men are You're breaking some of my missiles. Slingers. That's impressive. Actually, no, let's pull you back, come on. Ready and waiting! Speed! Fire! Slingers! Double time! Heavies! Take aim! Pull oh. back! Our men flee the field of battle! This is a shame Ah, that's a shame. Lost a good amount of archers that would have liked to have kept, but... You win some, you lose some. Indeed. Levies. Thank you for just shooting my uh, light hot plate unit to pieces. I didn't like them anyway. That's fine by me. <laughs> so rude. Leave them alone. They did nothing to you. Missiles awaiting Jeez. Advance at speed. Ride at the bar. Come on now. Follow me. Heavies. Quick fire. Ready for orders. Ready. As advance at speed. Heavies. Get fire on the enemy. to command Italian cavalry right public aid cavalry ah oh, worth a try right forward <laughs> yeah I saw what's going on there sends back to your uh archers though Why is the capture point so close? That's the main question. <laughs> Just realised that. Oh wow, that cow just got incinerated. I was hoping for that as well, so thanks for that. It's alright. If you ever minded coming in to come and fight, that would be lovely. Uh, I could do. Depends how I'm feeling, really. <laughs> do you. Do what you need to do. Right, 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 
Come and fight me, you fool. Thanks, Grim. Just realised that. Just breaking that sword unit for free. <laughs> your general as well, Jesus. Uh, no, my general's over here. He's well and truly protected. Well and truly protected, you can't get him. To see what you're trying to do. Can't fool me. Right. Here comes the real test. Oh, come on, how are you breaking there?
get yourself out of combat. Come on, what are you doing there, you stupid slingers? Just... Idiots. 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 And you got my cav, which is very well done. Shoot them inside. Don't know why this thing is getting trapped in stupid places. I had them all on like skirmish mode and stuff like that. Oh, you <laughs> somehow managed to get through that. Really should be holding. And your calves trying to get round, but that's not going to happen. I think it just did, didn't it? No, it's no, it's not going to matter anymore. Anyway. No, not that. Oh, I wasn't on about that one. I was on about the one that was in the spear unit. Ah, well played, Scrim. In the end, it kind of came down to your arches. Yeah, it did as well. Whew! I wasn't, I wasn't expecting to win that at all. Well, it's a very hollow victory because they die next turn anyway. Well, we'll see what happens. What, a 20 sack against? I'm probably just going to auto resolve it, mate. <laughs> what? There would be no need. The ban like, there's the amount of troops you got left against a full. Stack, what's the point? I'm not gonna, yeah, yeah, I... makes it's sense. It. it might blow a couple of mercs. Uh, hmm, maybe I don't think so. I don't think I will have killed off many units. That's the thing, I don't think they have many free slots. I managed to save the majority of the range as well, actually. Yeah. In fact, all the hot plots are still intact ah, as well. Well, done. I'll just concede defeat. That's a pretty Oh, no, I don't want to save it. <laughs> no, 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 no point saving that. Um, oh. Yeah, I don't think I killed enough of your stuff off to make it... Apparently it's close. I don't know. I killed a lot of your Javis and stuff, but most of the hot plates survived. They were intact. Yeah, uh, maybe I would have done better fighting you in the field. Might have done better fighting you <laughs> in the field, actually. Who knows? Well, I, I really wasn't expecting to win that. I'm actually uh, surprised. Yes, it's annoying, but it means I can rebuild that other legion very close to my front with uh, thingy now. I God, guess. they're on the doorstep of Rome, early. What? Not far off Rome. They've got another two provinces, and they're in the shot distance. Who? Region. Yeah. Yeah. In theory. Ch ch yeah. In theory. I mean, they've literally just gone past everything and sniped that middle settlement. Well, they went by C. Oh, I actually can't take it this turn. Wow. I actually can't take it back, retake really it this turn. That's a shame. Oh, that's going to be a tough one for you then. Uh, not really. I'll rebuild the Legion. They've uh, got a full militia as well. The garrison's fully back up. Oh, uh, well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I think uh, we should fight that. I think we should fight that. I want to see what happens. We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> Uh, right, what are we going to do about this then? I will... I think I'm going to move that there. Deal with you in turn, like so. You clear off over there, as expected. You can come into there. Um, hmm. We'll see. I might fight it. I might just build up a... Big ass army in one <laughs> turn and re and knock them all out anyway. So, might not be the end of the world. See, House of Fabia, House of Fabia, House of Amelia, House of Fabia. I'm not none of those. I'm House of Furia. Which one likes me the most? Fabia likes me the most. I can secure loyalty. Why do they hate me so much now? Imperium. Okay. Um, 
Let's put it in Fabio then. Let's put which one's the best? Probably you. Reinstate Legacy of the Third. Which one's cheaper? You. Oh no, you're cheaper. And then let's just knock together about all of them. Actually, no, not all of them. Let's put like so. Perfect. Right. So that should sort that out. I don't think they can attack in one turn. That's a decent garrison. And it's not atrocious. Um, I need to do something with this legion down here. Can I make? Can I make? Oh god, down? that's a nasty army. What? Uh, the Carthage army is quite nasty. Ah. They're all Croton. That's fine. Lots of mercenaries are nice as well. I may have to trespass into Croton's land just to deal with the Salmonites because otherwise they're just going to keep harassing me. Yeah, I can see the army there. Yeah, that kills them off. 86%. And then they die, and I kill them. Nice. Weren't the Salmonites allies of Rome at the start? I uh, don't think so. I think they were always mortal enemies. I could be wrong. But I'm, I'm, as far as I'm aware, I'm pretty sure they were always mortal enemies in some... Well, it might be, I might be wrong. I don't know, Scream. I do not know. Indeed. Um, right. So it has put a bit of a spanner in the works, is that, but... <laughs> Sorry. Yes, but it can be resolved. I'm going to raise a fourth, uh, another legion anyway, a fifth legion, in fact. Lots of legion raising going on, and we're going to the. Uh, apparently, this is the sixth legion, but it's lying. Let's rename this immediately, and it's not going to be called the Montana. It should be called Let's Kill Scrim. Montana. Yeah, and that's an awful name. It's part of America. <laughs> I was going to say it sounds like a very uh, American name. Yes. Um, I don't know. We'll name it um, Sabine. Yeah. Why not? After the place that we. Uh, Raise the legion. That sounds apt. <laughs> sounds apt. Um, and then we'll raise some more, mm, more swords. I think. Uh, gonna take a massive tank to the economy. How many? Okay, we can get five. That's fine. We can start to make our offensive uh, against them. That's fine. So we have got some legions that are part of a disloyal house. Well, not a disloyal house, but part of a less loyal house. Um, gonna bulk up the economy where I can. Actually, I should really put troops into this army here because this is the army that's fighting a rebellion. But none of these do I really like. NATO Italian skirmishes could be an idea just temporarily. Hmm. Or could just recruit mercs and then just kill them off with mercs. Probably not the worst idea in the world, actually. Um, Compsa, that's doing its thing. Kinda needs to just carry on doing that. Uh, okay, running games. Um, let's put you in then. Let's put a small colonia in. Whatever that other that is, a colonia. Um, right. Very frustrating. That I couldn't reach you in one turn. I'm pretty sure I could. But hey. Hey ho. Um, See what happens. Yes, we will. I will probably end the turn, hand over to you. We'll do one more turn, I think, and then we'll wrap up this episode. No, see no if worries. I can uh, see if I can end <laughs> the Region's rule in this small region. Very frustrating. I make like one step forward and ten, take ten back. Very frustrating. Right, let's look at the generals available. Who are you? Um. Disciples of Zeus and my own dynasty. <sighs> I should really choose my own dynasty to be honest, particularly with um them constantly being rebellious against me. Hmm. Do 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 Swears like a trooper. <laughs> <laughs> um Fini you need something or other. Who are you then? I don't know who he is. He doesn't want to tell me. Oh. And who are you? That's Cyber Zeus. Oh, okay. Uh, 
Plans, plans, plans. What are we doing? Uh, I suppose we could probably look at the economy for now. Let's have some extra income coming in. Um. Uh, Samanites have rebelled in my uh, city. This is not good. Oh dear. And the garrison's not brilliant here. Hmm. Why do you hate this? Why does this region hate me so much? Still just charging forward for a little. I don't think I'm doing Cultural right. differences. It's a huge bloody navy I've got as well. Um... It's taken blooming ages just to get through some of these factions. I'm not lying. It's just they're <laughs> gritty as hell. I mean, I hate the Reggie on joining this. Just for some reason, thought, yeah, we've got a good chance to play war. Yeah, we'll just, we've got a good chance. Fifty fifty. Fifty. And the next army they're bringing up is just full of mercenary hippies, cav, and hippies. <laughs> well, won't we find that one in the field? Uh, they have, geez, like in the toe of Italy, there's like so many settlements. And Region <laughs> holds like all of them. That makes up Italia. What? Why is Italia just like the toe of Italy? Yes. Hmm, what am I gonna... Makes entire oh. sense. I'm trying to make decisions on what I'm going to do. Burn them all. Yeah, probably. <laughs> um, yes. Right, so well, let's uh, look at economy. Now. There's no harm doing it. Um, you guys are good with farming, so let us get that sorted. Yes, yeah, so let's get some farms going. Um, let me get the other farm there. So, this is going to get the other farm there. Let us look at what construction costs and culture. Oh, so no, no, no. Us. Let's get back on that. Tactical Some train. That's going in there then. Um, I should probably. I need to look at that soon anyway. Uh, let us get. Oh, I can get some of these guys. Yeah, it's some of those guys hmm. and some of these guys. Hmm. How interesting. How good are you against these? You've got melee defense of six. Melee defense of ten. Bloody hell. Armor sixty. Yeah, you're not going to be picked. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. no, no. That's a no from me. It's a no from me, unfortunately. Uh, right. Upgrade you. Let's us. Uh, I've got basically everything I can get here. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Right, so not far off getting that. Uh, oh, so what have I got on these armies? Okay, yeah, got you. Right, so let us build some archers to begin with. Take it from there. Yeah, we'll leave. So that'll be six. Yeah, okay, that makes sense to me. Okay, that's in my turn. While my army slowly crawls up the north. Excellent. Keep it crawling. Indeed. It is just crawling though, it's taking some goddamn time. Well, it's because it's in a fleet, isn't it? Is that just the yeah, only reason? It. Yeah, it might be. It might be because armies just do not travel far, but the fleet can go for miles. This one just isn't going anywhere. Mm. But I need to take out I need to take out that large basic Carthaginian stronghold to the uh, west. I need um, to take out Neapolis. Their agents are still doing trouble. Still causing goddamn problems. Carthage seems to be retreating all of a sudden. Not two of their armies, they're just lingering, annoyingly. Hopefully, my allies will be able to hold on. Non aggression not... pact. Yeah, I'll take that. Go on. I need some uh, allies in these troubled times. <laughs> well, as long as you don't accidentally backstab them, I'm sure it'll be very good for you. Yeah, well, that was a one-time thing. A one-time <laughs> thing. Never again. Oh, your allies I made mean, one-time thing that caused everyone to... Oh, go they decided to carry on their attack. Oh, god damn it. Oh, god. Okay, you're in trouble, mate. 
Uh, they are going up for Rome, it would seem. They're just going to carry on going. They're going to snipe for Rome, Jesus. Um, well, if they do, then it's going to take uh, two, two attempts, and I don't think they'd do it. I mean, it looks like they might. Are you yeah. going to bother fighting that? 33% uh, remaining. I'll take that. Uh, there's no point. This one I just definitely can't win in comparison to the other one. Yeah, I was going to say, you just get an army raise as quick as you can now. That's looking quite dangerous. He's just sniped all the way up north. Yeah. It's really Jesus. annoying. Jesus. That's another, thing is you that's can another Legion dead. What? There's a back... Yeah. There's another Legion. Backtrack. Another chappy dead as well, actually. Rebellion in Kapua. Loyalty. Right. Uh, that was from Intimidation. Oh, Rome is not doing well. Uh, it's doing fine. Leave it out. <laughs> I mean, Rome yes, is fine. Wonderful. Rome is actually pretty safe now because now he's got to go after places with walls. So he can't take that in one turn. He needs to replenish his arm before he does anything. It looks pretty battered. Good. Hmm, I should know. Why would we do that when we could go for... Ooh, do we need more industry? We could always do more industry, I guess. Could always do more industry. Um, I'd rather go down public forum, though, I think. Get a forum going. Do I just take... Yeah, I'm just going to take that city back by force, just for the income. And then I'm going to march out, I think, if I can. I don't know if I can. There we go, yeah. Uh, no, I can't, but I can start to move my other army up. I'll recruit a load more stuff here. Um, Just be careful he doesn't attack it, though. If he does, then I think I can hold him back. I could get a load of... 6 versus 19, I'm not too sure. Well, I can pull back and he will be not be able to catch it. True. And that's fine, because that means then he's at least going for this army instead of attacking a settlement. Which I am... According to his range of control, he can actually reach Rome next turn. Yeah, that's fine. Don't mind. He can go for Rome. <laughs> Which one's the more loyal faction again? Pub oh, neither are loyal. Neither are loyal. Uh, secure House of Fabia. All my money then, it would seem. Brilliant. Uh, not great at all. Not great at all. Clearly they didn't like me... Uh, I don't know what I was even doing. I don't know what I was even doing. Um, Region is carrying on its way up north. That's fine. I'm going to... Probably isn't the best move in the world, but I'm going to try and take Neapolis. Mm. Actually, if I continue the siege, then they have to come out at some point, and they'll have to face me. In two what? turns' time, yeah. Which I'm perfectly fine with. Oh, this is a that's a problem, though. That's a problem. You fight for Rome. Attack! Hitting some stumbling blocks, I see. Not just yet. Just waste a load of money I could have used elsewhere, though. Run into a few stumbling blocks, yeah, but just the further we go south, the more rough time we're having, I won't lie. I could do with securing the north now. Um, the Sabines are sending an army off to attack Vei, which is a nine garrison, um, which is a little bit of a problem. I'll put in the Garrison for him for nothing. Just gets the extra unit, I guess. So it might put him off taking it. Um, and then we'll go north. Regan's really just caused me a lot of problems there. That's really annoying. Um, Sabines, do you... don't. Speak quickly. Do not expect the ah. to ease your parched throat when you are done. The people would see me experience the lictor's whips if I accepted your crude offer. Well, I got peace for the Sabines. Oh, nice. For 500, I got 500 gold out of them as well. Um, oh, so that's put that whole border um, less of a constraint. So now it's just dealing with Region and now, and then we can take 
uh, Neapolis in two turns as well, and then I can deal with rebellions in the south in just as many turns. Really. So that's actually not too bad. It's probably where we're going to have to wrap up this episode as well, guys. So if you've been enjoying this Let's Play, then please do continue to give it support with a like, a subscribe, and a comment. And until next time, Legionnaires, 